Welcome, Deronda here with Foods 101. Today, I'm showing you how to make these Christmas elf cookies. We always remember Santa Claus during the holidays, but we need to start remembering the little elves that visit as well. And this is their favorite cookie. What you're gonna need for these elf cookies is two and a half cups of bread flour, one half cup of powdered sugar, plus you're gonna need more to roll these cookies in after they bake, one half cup of pistachio nuts that I've chopped finely, one cup of butter at room temperature, a half a cup of dried cranberries that I've also chopped very finely as you can see here, and you're gonna need a half a teaspoon of salt and one teaspoon of pure vanilla extract. Let me show you how we're gonna get this elf cookie together. I'm adding my butter in small little cubes here in a medium sized mixing bowl. And to this, I'm going to add that half cup of powdered sugar that we need in these cookies. With a mixer on medium, we're going to mix this till it's nice and creamy. And looking like this, now we're going to add those pistachios and those dried cranberries. Oh my goodness, that smells so yummy. A little bit of the salt. Well, actually you're gonna add all the salt. And we're going to add a teaspoon of vanilla. I just eyeball it. We're gonna mix this together till it's well blended. You may wanna use a spatula to scrape down the sides. Look at those beautiful little speckles of red and green in that dough. I think the elves are gonna love this cookie. We're gonna add a little bit of our bread flour in at a time. I like using a wooden spoon. It makes it a little bit better to incorporate. And you're gonna work a little bit at a time till you get all your flour worked in. When your dough starts looking like this, you're going to get your cookie sheet out. Now I've got mine lined with parchment paper. I'm going to take a little bit of dough. This is about mm, probably a couple of tablespoons of dough. And we're gonna lie it over here on our lined parchment paper. And we're gonna continue doing this until we have them all rolled out. This cookie is a lot like shortbread with a little acidic from your dried cranberries. And of course you get a little protein from those pistachio nuts that are beautiful in color. Bake your cookies in a 350 degree preheated oven for the next 16 minutes. Cookies have baked and we're going to let them cool here on the cookie sheet for the next 10 minutes before we transport them because you don't want your cookies falling apart. But don't they look delicious and if you could be here in my kitchen and smell them, oh yummy, these elves are going to be very happy. After 10 minutes of cooling these elf Christmas cookies. We're going to roll them in powdered sugar one time, and then we're gonna let them cool completely, and then we're gonna roll them in powdered sugar again. And get the kids in the kitchen. They love doing this and create wonderful holiday memories with them. And believe me, when the elves show up, all the cookies they put out are going to be gone. They're that delicious. I've been putting on my second coating of powdered sugar now that these um, Christmas elf cookies has completely cooled down. And as you can see, they look like these little adorable snowballs. Once you put this second coating of powdered sugar on, and oh my goodness, I can already tell these are going to be absolutely delicious. Now if you need to add a little bit more powdered sugar to your bowl here, by all means do. Here's our Christmas elf cookies, and I gotta give it a try, and look on the inside. Look how those green pistachios and that dried cranberry comes through and shows you very lovely Christmas colors, and the flavors are gonna be absolutely fantastic. I'm gonna give it a try. Mmm, just like a shortbread with this lovely acidic cranberry. These delicious little crunchy pistachios. Hey you all, you're gonna have the happiest elves visiting your home in the whole entire world. These are absolutely delicious. Absolutely melts in your mouth. The lovely little powdered sugar on the outside is fantastic. Hey y'all, leave me a comment, give me thumbs up, 
Merry Christmas to you. Happy Holidays. And I'll catch you next time.